Today, I want to focus a little bit on the importance of uh, reading in the area of disability, culture, and personal stories. Uh, for me, it's been very important as we argue about the absence of disability in media, that one of the areas we're really focusing on is supporting people who have disabilities who are writing about their lives. One book I'd like to suggest is uh, Disability Visibility, First Person Stories from the 21st Century. Uh, why I think this is a great book is there are many people who have written brief stories about their lives and people with very many different types of disabilities. So this to me is a great book. It'll allow you to see whether any of your stories are in here and whether they're here directly or not, you will be able, in my view, to empathize and to gain strength from the stories people are telling. Then there are many other books that are out there um, and uh, we'll share some of those links. But, you know, for example, this great book, Sitting Pretty by Rebecca Towson. And what I also really like is Sonia Sotomayor, who, as many of you will know, is a member of the Supreme Court. And she has diabetes. And she's had diabetes since she's a child. So this book, this one that I hold here, is one which is focused for younger people. She also has her autobiography. So at the end of the day, I hope that this year you can commit um, to going to your library virtually or in person, hopefully soon, talking to your librarian about books that you could get. My book, for example, Being Human, is available in many libraries, um, and you can also buy these books online. So enjoy reading. Please feel free to share information about books and materials you're reading. Look at the New York Times. They have great pieces that are put in quite regularly, um, personal stories of disabled, written by disabled individuals. So have a good year reading, and let's all share that information with our audience. Thank you.